Hey guys, I am Trevor and I'm here with, introduce yourself. My name is Katie Groves, aka Caden Scroovenstein. Scroovenstein, alright, we're grooving to the steen. Okay, let's get down it. Do you hate my kind? Like men. Your lyrics come across as, quote unquote, I want to castrate the man you know. Um, I actually love men a lot and that's why I have to write those lyrics because men don't love me. Hmm, I like that answer. So, um, second off, moving along, uh, how does it feel being the gory Gary Coleman of music, Forever Young? <laughs> I mean, good? Feels good. good. Gary Coleman. Well, I think it was just a reference to how young you look. Yeah. And you can take that as beautiful, young, or you can take it as like fresh, fresh midget, pup fresh. Yeah. Um, midget. It's pretty. Yeah. I'm not a midget though, because you have to be 4'11. And uh, so you plus, don't get. You legally don't get money. My fingers are very long. You don't collect money from the government. Not for, common with the midget family where they're very short. No, not very. I have piano fingers. My mom told me so. Okay. So it says here. I quote. Every girl is capable of murder. Your new single, I'd like to ask you, if you had to murder one guy, Kevin Bacon, Michael Jackson, Lady Gaga. Do I have to choose from those three? No, 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 no. Those okay. are just a couple references. Um, from those three men. Of course, uh, Michael Jackson's dead, and Kevin Bacon might as well be too. And Lady, <laughs> Lady Gaga, no one knows if it's a man. Kevin Bacon was in that movie Tremors, which was so good. Right? So um, you would not want to kill him. Let's wouldn't want to kill out. him. Not Kevin Bacon. I would want to kill the last guy that I dated because he's the reason for the song Murder. Okay. That's a great answer. Um, moving along here. Uh, when I say mouth hug, what or how do you feel? Mouth hug. I think of the 10 second Frencher, which I want to give to anyone and everyone. Man or woman? If it feels right, I don't if know. If it feels right, all right. I... It depends, are we talking woman like Lady Gaga or a man like Lady Gaga? Uh, <laughs> however you perceive it at the point. Okay. All right, your charm is that of a precious troll doll, but I hear you're going, a, you got a dirty mouth. What celebrity would you let clean it? Oh. Man or woman, again. John Stamos, Uncle Jesse. Uncle Jesse, that's a solid answer. Is that a reference to the Step Brothers movie, or you just have a fascination? I've never seen Step with... Brothers, so it's no reference. You've never seen Step Brothers. No. All right, so someone needs to buy it for her. Let's get that out there. Okay, so nothing on the precious troll comment. At all. I don't want to be a precious troll, although I used to, I used to um, collect trolls when I was a kid. Really? Yeah. Did you used to brush their their hair. They brush their hairs. Yeah. Okay, awesome. Um, last question: How does it feel being 15 and traveling the world? <laughs> Are your parents worried that you may end up the next Teen Mom or Lindsay Lohan? Well, I'm already pregnant, so that's out. Yo! Yeah. Um, I'll be 16 soon. 16 asshole. soon. <laughs> Actually, I'm almost 22, Five, but. Six. Five, six. <laughs> <laughs> <Awesome>. <laughs> All right, so I think that wraps up our interview here with Katie Groves. Katie Scrivenstein. Scrivenstein. Cadencia de las Suarez. Amen to that, sister. Love you, bud. Love you, too. <laughs> Thank you for being a trooper. I'm Katie Groves, and Pup Fresh is so fresh. Nailed it. Nailed it.